Hey everyone, Jamie Phillips, Action Auto Parts. Well, we pulled it out here from the house, but we're gonna try to drive it back. Oh, so I told Peg, I said, put some gas in it and we'll take her back home and then probably bring in a Zuzu that I've got for sale out here. Because you can't see it from the house, you know, when you're driving by, but here you can. So hopefully, the only thing the old truck's not doing is not wanting to idle good. Okay. He said it didn't shut the hood all the way on it. So uh, I may try to get either a kit, which I've never rebuilt a carburetor, but either that or get another carburetor for it. But uh, he said it's just not wanting to idle. But other than that, it's sounding a lot better. And uh, he's drove it all over the farm. So I said, well, let's just take it home. I get the Cougar. Uh, I get the Cougar done and out of the garage at home, then I can back that in there and do a little stuff on it. That was kind of what my plan was this winter's have some room in the garage to get in there and tinker on some different things. So uh, that'd be good. But old Peg, he getting to drive it before me, but it's all right, he got it going. He got it to where we can drive it around. So hopefully it's gonna make it, it's made in voyage all the way back to the house on its own power. One of the tires didn't want to stay up on it. And it blows my mind that it did, but he got underneath of it and got the old spare. It's on the passenger side rear and uh, he put it on there. So I guess as long as it gets it out to the house, I've got a compressor and stuff out there, but I'm excited. I like it old truck. I always like the odd, kind of the odd stuff, like the strike package vehicles and things like that. I know I'm bouncing you all around with my phone, but I can't get comfortable sitting here and then trying to talk and hold it and drive at the same time. But uh, I like the ones that's a little bit different. <clears throat> and that's, you know, the two-tone paint strike package. It's a sport package. It's a Scott, Scottsdale, but then the hood ornament and all that says sport <clears throat> on it. So uh, I like that odd stuff, but that'll be a good one to get in the garage once I get the Cougar done and uh, do a little bit of cleaning and some stuff on it and maybe get a tune-up kit because I'm sure it could stand a tune-up. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, pretty exciting to see the old truck coming back out the road on its own power. I, I just love this old stuff. You know, and I'm not I'm not saying it because I can't afford one, but I've said before I would rather have, uh, you know, 25 $2,000 cars than one $50,000 car. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, you just got that much more you can enjoy. You know, in that old truck, she's rough and everything else, but uh, at the same time, I just think it's cool. I like old square bodies. 79 is really my favorite year because I like the black grill and the way the chrome goes around the the parking lights and stuff like that on it but uh but yeah it uh it's done <laughs> it's done pretty good that dog take the dump out on the edge of the road <laughs> the things you see on my youtube channel um yeah he's trying to take a dump and we interrupted it but yeah the old truck like see you know it ain't been smoking it did a little bit when we first got it you know got it going but uh yeah it's uh it's done pretty good so we're gonna take it to the house we're almost there and uh and we got to take the battery off of it because it actually goes on Odell, the service truck. And uh, we're going to, I'll let him drive that Azuzu back out here, some park it out front and throw a for sale sign or something on it. But uh, here we are at the old homestead. So we drug it out the road, I don't know, a month or two, a couple months back. And it didn't really get much done to it. And then Peg Leg got it going. And so here we are. I'm going to get his attention, tell him to maybe park it out back. so we can get the battery off of it. And, uh, I appreciate y'all tuning in. Let me uh, comment, give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, please subscribe. And uh, who knows, we might be doing one on the love truck or the little dot soon here before too long. But uh, I appreciate it. Y'all check out Beaver and Sun Garage at Bethel, Ohio, and I will catch you in the next one.